Hi everyone, just um, going to make a video about um, posting an event. So here we go. I'm going to create an event so that this is the easiest way to get started. Now you could have got several photos in here that you can work, so let's just change a the theme and stuff, but you can also use your own photos. So how about I just go and grab a shot and why don't we pick one for a nice scene that I made last week. So let's just use that one and set that as the theme. And so, and it should have positioned it better. Right, okay, let's make a title. So we're gonna hang out with xyz.com as the title um, location can be details let's just do the same so we are going to have fun xyz.com very good now the other thing to be careful with this is then the posting oh you can post the time so we can actually change the date time thing let's do it tomorrow just because getting very close to that time. Um, we can actually post a basic event where guests can invite other people, guests can add photos, or you can hide the guest list. What I am interested to show you is to go to the advanced section, which you can host a Google Hangout. You can make this live as a Google Hangout to YouTube, so it shows for everyone to watch, even those not in your circles and show additional fields. Now I want to show you the next step for this, show additional fields. In here we can place um, a website else, so let's just xyz.com for instance. We can send it to Eventbrite. .com, so it'll pick that up. And then we'll use a video URL. So I've just got one here, which I've already done. And I'm going to just post that in there. So it will take a YouTube video only. Um, if you need to post videos from other sites, they are just normal website URL and they can go in the description. You can put anything you like in there. You can link, do the whole bit. It's really easy. The other aspect to this is to make this public. There's a reason for a public post in here. What that does, you can put anything else in, you can make other people in there, but what's really, really important is to make it a public event because you can change and add it and edit and do all the rest to that later. Not that you want to edit too much because um, it sends a, a notification out to everyone. So we're just setting that event and it will show up in a minute. Right, there's our event. And it shows that I'm going and that I haven't invited any more guests. I can plus one, I can play the little video. So let's just do that. Just so that, right, it shows up. And so that little video that I created before is just all running there. So that's me and my muggin. We can post a photo during the event or after the event. So this is really cool because it allows you to say, yeah, we're having a lot of fun. So let me just pick a photo. Um, why don't we just pick one here and we just posted this photo. This is just one that I did. Uh, let's skip tagging because I don't need to tag anything. And then um, there's a photo of Brisbane City and I hang out in really unique places. Cool fun that is. Um, and then you can plus one that and people can see, oh, we're, we're here in Brisbane. So that's pretty neat. So that's about all I can think of at the moment. If you have more questions, please get hold of me and say, oi, what about the photos? What have I got to do? What about this bit? How do I invite more people? All those sorts of things. How do I share the event? What other little things that I can do um, in settings and stuff? Always look helpful and looking to answer your questions. Have a great day.